Hello, this is Jonathan Freeman from Aladdin, and you are watching Fan Pop. <laughs> Hi, I'm Dr. Evan. Welcome to Fan Pop. Today we're talking with Jonathan Freeman, an actor who's had a long career in television, movies, and voice work. He's appeared on Law & Order, critically acclaimed film The Ice Storm, as well as Aladdin, where he voiced Jafar. Jonathan, thank you for joining us. It's a pleasure. So our first question comes from Fan Pop fan Iris. Can you ask him how it felt to work on a film that some call the pinnacle of Disney's hand-drawn animation era? It felt fantastic. At the time, it felt that something special was happening, and it was exciting to get to play a Disney villain, something I'd also wanted to do. Uh, it felt special because I think Gilbert, Gottfried, and Robin Williams uh, were in the film, and it felt like it was slightly edgier than a lot of um, Disney animated features that had come before it. It was a little bit more of its time, even though it was taking place in a very ancient time. So um, it was quite exciting. Um, recently, I was on a train with Gilbert, though, and we both agreed that we couldn't possibly have known, not in a million years, that it would have such legs. You mentioned Gilbert Goffrey, who voiced Iago, who was your sidekick in Aladdin. Um, what was it like working with him? Well, it was delightful. Um, <laughs> he would probably hate it if, I, if he knew that I was saying he's actually a gentleman. He's a lovely <laughs> man. He's a, a hilarious comedian and actor. And it was a pleasure. The majority of the work that I did with other actors was with, with Gilbert, obviously, because we had most of our scenes together. And being together in the same room really helped that relationship on the screen. I had a lot of fun, and I enjoyed all of his uh, shenanigans, and it was a great experience. And in Aladdin, of course, you play Jafar, who is the supervillain. Uh, give us your favorite line in his voice. Well, my favorite one, which I actually get to say eight times a week, you know, in the Broadway show, is, My most abject and humble apologies, Your Majesty. I like all of those sort of fawning, smooth, mercurial lines that they wrote when Jafar was on his best behavior and not displaying his um, psychotic behavior. I always thought that those were, those were the most fun to play with. <laughs> Your Majesty certainly has a way with dumb animals. And our last question comes from fan pop fan Prue Fever, who asks, what is your favorite Disney movie besides Aladdin, of course? I like all of the Disney movies that have the great villains in them. Peter Pan is a, a favorite of mine. I still love Hans Conried as Captain Hook. Um, Maleficent, unmistakably one of my favorite villainesses of all time. I think that she is the most akin to Jafar. They both have funny hats and birds and staffs. I like Stromboli and Pinocchio, and I like the sidekicks, the cat and the fox, I think those sort of devious villains, you know. Great. Jonathan, thank you. And uh, before you go, what are you a fan of? Well, right now, I am a very big fan of a book written by Ron Suskind called Life Animated about his son, Owen Suskind. He was on the autistic mm -hmm. spectrum and had late, uh, early onset uh, uh, autism. How to speak and how to relate to the world by watching Disney animated movies. It's a spectacular story. It's a great book. He's a wonderful writer, uh, which is going to be a wonderful documentary, been directed by uh, Roger Ross Williams, an Academy Award-winning documentary filmmaker. That documentary comes out in January of uh, 2016. Great. Jonathan Freeman of Aladdin, which is being re-released by Disney in October for their Diamond Blu-ray edition. It's going to be entirely remastered. Thanks for joining us. I'm Dr. Evan for Fan Pop. And remember, we ask celebrities interview questions from our subscribers. Subscribe to us on YouTube. You'll be the first to know when we're at taking questions for our next interview.